Hi, Paul Akers. I'm going to show you how to make a desk door display. This is an amazing product, and as you see in our showroom, we have it set up here with a visqueen wall, but not every showroom has a ceiling. A lot of them are very tall, and you can't actually make a desk door, but we've got a way to do it with a new tripod system, and I'm going to show you how, so come on. In order to do the dust door system, you need a few things. You need two third hands, you need two of the new third hand tripods, and you need a dust door, and that's it. Now, when you take your third hand out of the box, you'll notice that our original or typical collar on the bottom for the micro adjust actually has a collar going on the outside of the red pole. The problem is that will not work in the tripod system like this. So in every tripod that we sell, we include a new micro adjust insert. So all we have to do is knock this off and put in the new one, and I'll show you how to do that. So just take a piece of wood that has a pretty sharp edge on there, take it and tap with your hammer just like that, and that will come off right off the end. Then take the new one, put it in there like that, and again, tap it back on, thread your insert back in, and you're done. It's that simple. It's very fast, very easy. And now that micro adjust, when you pop the foot off the bottom, will slip right through the tripod, as you can see right there. Okay, we've prepared both of our third hands. Now we just need to put on the tripod one at a time. Make sure you press on the ball detents right here to slip and pass that collar. And notice how this slips in there perfectly, just like that. And now we're going to stand one up. Make sure that you go ahead and push the tripod down so that the foot is not resting on the bottom, right there, and then tighten it up. One done. Okay, we're just going to open up our box real quick, and we'll see what's inside for our dust door. We'll open that all up and get all the parts out, and we'll be good to go. So there's our dust door. And here's our top support with our clamps and our bottom support. We'll pull off the clamps off of that one. You know it's the bottom support because it has the magnets on both sides and it has the part that fits in to the bottom of the third hand micro adjust. So you're just going to loosen your tension knob and now you're going to make your ball detent snap into place just like that and now you're done and retighten it. Do the same thing over on this side. It's very fast, very easy. Loosen your knob, snap it into place, then retension this. So as you can see, you have both your tripod legs going out like this so you can walk through easily, and then this leg should be extended straight out. Then we can put the dust door on here. It will seal down here, and everything should work perfect. The next step is loosen your tension knob right there, Grab your ball detents at the bottom, which are double, lifting up on the handle, and just extend this all the way up. Make sure that, again, your black line right here is lined up in the hole, and that will make sure that the ball detent snaps into place. As you can see, that works right there. Okay, this is my top header pole, and then I've got my dust door, and it's just like a shower curtain. Just stick that through there, feed it on through, and then we'll clip it into place. There we go. Then we'll turn it around so you can see clearly what I'm doing. And you just clip that into there like that. And you clip it into there. And you make sure that it's hanging about the right length. The right length is hanging down so these metal clips right here are magnet magnetizing right on this side or on that side, depending upon whether you're going to the front and back. So you can see I hung it up there the first time almost perfect, just like this. One other thing I want to point out, to make sure the header is level at the top, look at the bottom here and make sure that this is about falling in the middle of the pole. Do you see how that's in the middle of the pole? And then go over to this side and the same thing. And it looks just about right. I got it the first time. The next step is really easy. You take the extrusion clamps and you start to put them on. You can start at the top and you clip one on right like that. And right here we can put another one on. We'll, we'll come right down here to the bottom and put this one on. right there. We want to make sure that as we're doing this, we're not pulling the joint apart. So again, we'll start up here. That's on. Making sure not to pull too hard. And we can always take it off and adjust it. That's the nice part about it. And then we'll go ahead and put this one right there like that. 
And now before we go any further, before we put on more clamps here, let's do a quick test and see if it works. It's that easy. And all we have to do is put in the rest of the clamps and it seals up great. So see how this is pulled apart right here? It's a little tight. All you need to do is pull off the tension off of one of them and make sure that you're not pulling it open as you put this on. See how I put that one on? And that one. So there you go, you've got five clips evenly spaced. So there you go, you got five clips evenly spaced. We can put one there, we can put one right there. We'll come over to this side and we'll space them out just a little bit better. Right there. You can bring one down right there. And we'll bring this one right about there. So evenly spaced all the way down. And now three across the top. Now the ones across the top, you don't normally need them. But the reason we're putting them on is because they represent if plastic was on here and you were holding plastic onto this. Now one last little detail that I like to do, I like to put this one right here at the very top to make sure that the cross member stays up. And by doing that, it makes it a little more supportive so this can't slide up and down very easily. Okay, there's the setup of the showroom dust door. It's that simple. And now your customers can walk through over and over again and experience basically the magic of the dust door from Fastcap. It is awesome.